This is one of the best TV systems I've seen in a hotel. It's in Oasia Hotel. It gives you info about the hotel. It's the home page. Very beautifully done. You get messages with the deals and offers. You get a list of TV channels. The guest services. These are the restaurants and uh, bars they have. They have uh, detailed info about uh, what you get and the opening hours, etc. Would have uh, provided menus too. They also give you a handy phone in the room and some promotions. Very nice way to show off promotions. The in room dining. Nicely done. I think they could have done with a few more photos. It's a clever idea. And they also have a list of uh, attractions that you can see in Singapore with a uh, detailed info. You can also get on a uh, Twitter and login. They also have a weather app. You can also log into your uh, Spotify account and the news app, YouTube app works quite well. This was the pre roll ad. TV is perfectly calibrated, not many hotels uh, take that much care when you first enter the hotel. It even welcomes you with your name. The best TV systems I have seen in a hotel. All the channels were very clear. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this Poka Ice Melon Tea. Bringing you the richest aroma and the refined taste. Nice packaging. It's melon iced tea, brewed from tea leaves, melon juice added, refreshing thirst quencher. It's manufactured in Singapore, costs around 250 rupees or around 5 dollars or so. It's the nutritional info. So let's taste it. That's how the tea looks. Let's taste it. It's a really light tea but you get nice melon flavor, very little sugar and uh, really refreshing. The melon and tea flavor uh, go surprisingly well together. Very tasty. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this lapel microphone. It's a unbranded uh, cheap microphone. Costs around uh, 150 rupees or uh, two dollars or so. This is what we get. This plugs into the microphone port and you can plug in your headphones here to listen in. And that's the mic. You get a really sturdy clip. The whole thing feels really well made. This is how it compares with my regular mic. Hello guys, let's take a look at this lapel mic. Surprisingly good for the price. This is the audio from my costly zoom mic. This sounds quite good, but it's very pricey. It is surprisingly good for a cheap mic. Quite nice. Check it out. 
Let's take a look at this uh, Japanese biscuit. Costs around uh, one Singapore dollar or around uh, 50 rupees or so. It's really big. That's how the back looks. I don't think you can finish uh, one of these in one go. Looks quite dry. It's very flaky with a uh, sprinkled sugar on top. Let's taste it. Really flaky and uh, quite dry. Very mildly sweet. This one go really well with uh, any hot beverage. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this Toto automatic toilet. It opens up as soon as you enter the bathroom. Don't even have to lift the lid. You can also raise it with the remote. That's how the remote looks. It has two cleaning uh, nozzles. One for the rear and one for the front and a dryer and these two bars control the pressure and the position you can save up to two programs you can stop them anytime use the buttons on the side to control these if you flip the remote is to control the water temperature the heat of the toilet seat and the speed of the dryer there are few more other settings. The one has a button to close the lid. It's quite tricky to show it because it only works when you are sitting on it. So I had to cover the sensor with my feet. Couldn't find the price for this exact model. Cost more than a lakh or a thousand thousand dollars or so really luxurious and uh, quite fun to use and this is how you control them with your uh, remote quite nice check it out let's take a look at this bittersweet dark chocolate it's by Mason and Co, Craftsman of Chocolate, 75% dark chocolate, bean to bar, organic, vegan and a single origin, crafted in India, really beautiful packaging. This is our signature dark chocolate, yeah. a high cacao percentage and a minimal sugar. This is for the lovers of dark chocolate. Our cacao beans are directly sourced from organic farms in India. We never add any chemicals, preservatives or emulsifiers. Every bar is made using our unique bean to bar process in our artisan factory in uh, Auroville, India. The 75% in the front of the packet refers to the amount of pure cacao in each bar. This has about 300 calories. It's manufactured at uh, Mason's Chocolate Private Limited in uh, Aroville, India. Costs around uh, 320 rupees or uh, 6 dollars or so. Ingredients are uh, organic whole cacao beans, organic cane sugar, organic cacao butter. So let's taste it. That's how it looks. Let's taste it. It has a really rich dark chocolate taste. A bit on the bitter side. Only a hint of sweetness. But it's really rich and uh, very tasty. Especially if you like uh, bitter dark chocolate. 
quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at these uh, bongo drums. I thought these were uh, quite pricey. These are actually quite cheap. This costs around uh, 300 rupees or uh, 6 dollars or so. You get uh, two drums made out of wood which are uh, hollow at the bottom. That's how they make the sound. Smack them to make uh, interesting sounds. A really interesting instrument. Quite cheap and uh, very well made. And uh, really fun to play. Let's take a look at this triple X strong mints, interesting packaging. These are peppermint flavored, extra strong mints, costs around 200 rupees or uh, 4 dollars or so. Can you handle them? That's the nutritional info. This has about 200 calories. So let's see if I can handle it. So let's taste it. That's how it looks. Let's taste it. It's really strong. You get a lot of peppermint flavor. It's quite chalky and a really strong mint with a lot of peppermint. I think I can uh, handle it. Really nice mint. Very little sugar. Really nice peppermint flavor. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this Singapore Arts Museum. There are exhibits in uh, all these rooms. That's the theme. There are quite a few interesting artworks on the way. You are not allowed to make video or uh, take photos inside the room. So I could only shoot what was available outside. The artwork on the inside were uh, very interesting and very strange. This is a really interesting uh, Mural. Also had this interesting uh, clock artwork. That was the time. Uh, every minute they keep sweeping the dirt around to show you the time. This is the art museum, but it's under renovation. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this mixed fruit parfaiti. That's how it looks. You get uh, quite a few fruits and nuts. Mango was in season. That's why you see the mango on top with some cashew nut and uh, almond. And uh, a nice cup of ice cream. Tastes really good with those uh, dried nuts. You get this seasonal kiwi fruit. Again, uh, tastes really good with that uh, sweet ice cream. This costs around uh, 150 rupees or uh, 3 dollars or so. Very tasty, fruity, perfect. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this 
samosa toast sandwich from Gangotri. It comes packaged like this. Costs around uh, 97 rupees or around uh, 2 dollars or so. It's just a samosa smashed between uh, two breads and uh, toasted. It's a brilliant idea because uh, samosa has everything uh, that you need. It has mashed uh, potato and uh, all the necessary spices to make it really interesting. The crunchy toast adds another uh, texture. It's one of those dishes that makes uh, so much sense once you see it. This makes for a really nice snack and uh, it's really clever. Quite nice. Chigiru. Let's take a look at this Rogovan pink notebook. This is from the paint box series. A notebook designed with a soft touch cover with colored pages. The book is most liked by both professionals and a creative person for its unbashed use of color and its simplified aesthetics. Do everything you love. It's A6 size. You get 240 pages. This costs around uh, 400 rupees or uh, 8 dollars or so. That's their website. Nothing on the cover. There is a logo on the back. Looks really beautiful. Some info about a rubber band. Really beautiful notebook, quite nice, check it out. Let's take a look at this drink from the table. Good food loves you. The table cutting, this is their uh, popcorn shake, costs around uh, 145 rupees or around uh, 2 dollars or so comes in this unique bottle. So let's taste it. It has this artificial popcorn flavor. Very unique tasting. I think few popcorn pieces would have uh, given it a nice texture and uh, improved the taste. Tastes a bit too artificial for me. Very unique taste though. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this Peking Chicken Wind Up Toy. This is from the Mint Toy Museum in Singapore. Costs around 250 rupees or 5 dollars or so. Comes in this retro packaging. Very simple packaging. It's made in China. That's the price. So let's see what do we get. It's a tin wind up chicken. Interesting design.
looks like this doesn't want to eat so let's open and see how the mechanism looks That's how it looks. I think the spring is worn too tight. No idea how to fix it. Interesting though. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this mainland China vegetable dumplings. It comes in a box like this. That's how the dumplings look these are uh, spinach dumplings the green color comes from the spinach that's how the insides look it's quite bland on its own costs around uh, 250 rupees or around uh, five dollars or so they give you four dipping sauces soy sauce and a green chili sauce and a mustard sauce and a red chili sauce all the sauces had a very unique flavor especially the red chili one very tasty and uh, very colorful looking quite nice check it out Let's take a look at these uh, Ayurvedic medicinal uh, face wash. It comes in this interesting uh, packaging. Each of these costs around uh, 83 rupees or a dollar and 50 cents. It can be used by both men and women. Really beautiful packaging. This is uh, helpful to control uh, blemishes and pimples, purifying the skin. That's the ingredient list. They also have uh, instructions on uh, how to use it. It's made in uh, Himachal Pradesh, India. So let's see how it looks. That's how it looks. Let's smell it. It has a really nice cucumber smell. This is the mixed fruit one, removes facial skin dirt, which prevents blemishes and pimples. Similarly priced. This has grape seed, apple fruit pulp, carrot fruit, aloe vera, almond seeds, and uh, some other ingredients. Smells very fruity. This is the lime and mint one. Removes dryness and roughness. Controls skin cracking. Again, similarly priced. This smells even better. Very pleasant uh, lime smell. All of these have uh, really beautiful smells and uh, they are Ayurvedic too. These were sent for review. If you are in the market for uh, face washes, try this out. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this desert from Gangotri. This is a sweet called uh, chenna pies you get a uh, cottage cheese balls in a uh, flavored milk the balls are uh, made out of uh, cottage cheese 
they are light and fluffy they have a spongy texture to them so they soak up all the flavored milk which is a uh, really fragrant and uh, very sweet when these milk balls absorb the milk it makes for a really unique uh, dessert very tasty costs around uh, 50 rupees or uh, 80 cents for this uh, small treat very flavorful and uh, very tasty quite nice check it out let's take a look at this mobile stand pen costs around uh, 120 rupees or uh, two dollars or so it also comes in quite a few colors that's how it looks that's where the stand is it's a regular pen you can even refill it and this is how it works as a stand it can hold uh, any phone you can also use it vertically but uh, it's less stable and it works with uh, all types of phones it also has a stylus on one end this might come handy especially while uh, traveling with this you can uh, have a pen and a stand and the pen too works quite nice check it out let's take a look at this cherry fruit i ate through most of it only then did i realize that uh, i haven't made a video of it that's why you see so few of them you get about 50 pieces for a uh, hundred rupees or a uh, two dollar or so these look quite uh, instagram worth these are the reason uh, i wanted to make the video because they look so good so the fruit looks once you bite into it you get a really big seed in the middle very little fruit cherries are uh, not as flavorful or uh, as sweet as uh, you find them in snacks it's a very delicate flavor quite nice check it out 